Today, we're diving into one of the wildest sounds ever recorded. Not from Earth, but from a black hole 240 million light years away in the Perseus Galaxy Cluster. Stick around to hear it for yourself and learn how NASA turned cosmic data into something we can actually hear. First off, you might be thinking, wait, sound in space? Isn't space silent? Well, not quite. While space itself is a vacuum with no air for sound to travel through, galaxy clusters like Perseus are different. They're packed with hot gas, millions of degrees hot, that surrounds hundreds of galaxies. Back in 2003, astronomers using NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory found something wild, pressure waves rippling through this gas, caused by a supermassive black hole at the cluster's center. These waves were like cosmic sound waves, but way too low for us to hear. 57 octaves below middle C, with a frequency that takes 10 million years to complete one cycle. Here's where it gets cool. NASA's team took those pressure waves, detected as X-ray data, and turned them into sound through a process called sonification. They extracted the waves moving outward from the black hole, then scaled them up by 57 to 58 octaves. That's a pitch shift of 144 to 288 quadrillion times higher than the original. Yes, quadrillion, with 15 zeros. The result? An eerie deep hum that sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie. Let's listen to it now. So how does a black hole make sound? It's not singing exactly. The supermassive black hole in Perseus, millions of times more massive than our sun, shoots out jets of energy that slam into the surrounding gas. This creates ripples, like dropping a stone in a pond, but on a galactic scale. Chandra, the world's most powerful X-ray telescope, picks up these ripples as changes in X-ray brightness. Scientists then filter the data, focusing on specific wave frequencies, and use audio synthesis to bring it into our hearing range. It's not just cool, it tells us how black holes shape their surroundings over millions of years. This isn't just a cool sound effect, it's a window into the universe. Sonifications like this help scientists, and even blind or visually impaired people, explore space in a new way. And Perseus isn't the only black hole with a voice. NASA also sonified the famous Messier 87 black hole using data from Chandra, Hubble, and radio telescopes. It's higher pitched, like ambient chimes. Check it out. These projects, led by the Chandra X-ray Center and NASA's Universe of Learning, show how data can become art and science at the same time. A black hole song sounds very daunting if you ask me. If you enjoyed this dive into the cosmos, hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for more space adventures. Want to hear more sonifications? Drop a comment below. I'll link some extras in the description. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Stay curious.